Hi everyone, how are you doing today? This is Kasha Zhu and you're watching CZZ. <laughs> today I want to geek out about words. I love, love, love language and um, I definitely personally believe that the way that someone speaks kind of can reflect to who they are, the words that they use, their intention, da -da 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 -da. obviously words are pretty manipulated today by the media, but um, I think the intention when you say something or um, the, the integrity of the words that you use have to come first. So intention, intention, intention. And um, so yes, I love language and um, English is not my first language. So sometimes I would take certain words and um, I would um, kind of associate them by how they sound. And then I will also kind of dissect certain words um, and analyzing their meaning or like how the meaning come about or like I also geek out about how one word can like evolve certain meanings like um, I mean queer for example queer <laughs> queer has been um, such a kind of common celebrated word now but don't forget actually 10 years ago it was very condescending to call someone queer um, but now that obviously we celebrate it and um, we will give ourselves like proudly proudly announce that hey I'm a queer I'm a queer um, so yeah um, so these are the words I geek out about God versus God do you believe in God that's somewhere outside of you or do, do you believe in your own God you know, God is exterior, your own God is interior. So do you create a God to believe, to make yourself, to behave good, or do you believe in your own God feelings? And then that's kind of what you follow when you do certain things, right? Do you believe in God or your own God? And uh, second is surrender versus serenity one is the verb of surrendering whether surrendering to a higher power something divine or something mysterious um, surrendering the, the part of like okay you surrender you no longer want to dictate some kind of control of it anymore and when you surrender you reach serenity which is calm, peacefulness, stay where you're not fighting, where you just feel one with everything, everything that's around you, everything that is above you, you're one with everything. Surrender yourself to reach serenity. Surrender, serenity. And another one is extraordinary versus ordinary. Extraordinary is a more ordinary or is it beyond ordinary and um, so sometimes I, I think about this and then I stumble upon um, the law of polarity and in law of polarity it states that everything is dual everything has poles everything has its pair of the opposite and opposites are identical in nature they're just different in degree. That's an interesting thoughts, right? Because when we think diff when we think about something different, we always think about is the other side of things. But what if it's actually just the same side and you just different in degree? It's a very interesting thoughts, right? Um, like introvert, extrovert, we're all actually just human beings. It's just how we get energy differently. You know, like extrovert gets energy from being around a lot of people and introvert gets energy from being with themselves. So in our, it's like an exterior, interior kind of thing again. Um, so extraordinary, ordinary. And um, another one is expensive versus expansive. <laughs> You know, this sounds so, so, so similar. Um, expensive, one is measured by uh, wealth, by uh, money. 
exterior. And the other one is expansive. It's a quality that you can possess within becoming bigger um, uh, in your personal growth um, or you are open-minded enough that you can encompass like so many different kind of perspective and that makes you rich in life. So expensive, exterior kind of measurements of richness and expansive which is your own rich you are in you're rich in your own personal growth are you expensive or are you expansive um, and this last one it's very simple you just kind of like pros and cons pros good cons bad prostitute versus constitute and in that we often look down on prostitute which is the oldest profession and we look up to constitution constitution which is men make rule but who are these men and what are their angles right like well, we look up to constitute, we look down to prostitute, pros and cons. Hmm. It's an idea to think about. Men made, nature made, men, nature, men, nature. Exterior, interior, interior, exterior, interior. Um, yeah, black and white, light and dark. Um, but everything is dual, everything has poles. Opposites, it's identical in nature, just different in degree. Anyway, these are the things I, I love to geek out about and um, these are just for fun. These are my personal view. Uh, you can agree, you cannot agree, um, but these are just the fun things I like to share. And um, that's all. <laughs> and if you have any more kind of this wordplay things that you find interesting, please send me. But again, I think um, whatever words you use, whatever, um, whatever things or energy you're trying to put out there, as long as you have good intention, I say go ahead and do it, and because that's the most important things. And um, that's it for today. If you like my video, please give me a thumbs up, share with your friends, leave a comment. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe for me. I'm trying to reach to a thousand subscribers, hopefully by the end of the year. And you must be very awesome, intelligent, and beautiful that you stumble upon my channel. And I hope you're having a really great day. Stay awesome. Love you. Ciao!